How is it going everybody? You're watching Then About Tech and if you're running iOS 26 beta and it doesn't matter which beta version it is, if it is developer beta, public beta, it doesn't matter. You have to watch this video. Okay guys, so we all know that iOS 26 is just around the corner. And probably the most common question everybody that's running a beta right now has is what should I do? How can I actually remove the beta and get the final, official, stable version of iOS 26 like everybody else? Well, it's super simple, guys. All you have to do really is, let's come back here to the very first page of our settings, and then let's go to General, and then Software Update, and then right here, all you have to do is tap on Beta Updates, and then it doesn't matter which beta you're running, developer or public, as I mentioned before, go ahead and turn it off. Also, it doesn't matter which beta version, like beta 6, beta 7, beta 8, you don't have to worry about any of that. All you have to do is turn it off, and then as you come back here, you're gonna wait. And then, as soon as Apple releases iOS 26 official, you're gonna see it right here, like everybody else. And it's so very important that you do this right now, when I'm releasing this video, because right now, everyone, including myself, we are on previous versions of iOS 26 compared to the official version. So we are in like beta 7, beta 8, so we are in previous versions, and that's perfect, because we're gonna turn off beta updates, and when the official version pops up right here, we're gonna be able to install it. But if you wait, if you don't turn it off, your iPhone is gonna keep updating and then you're gonna be in a later version than iOS 26.0. You may be in 26.1, in future versions, you're always gonna be in the beta loop and you're not gonna be able to update to the official version. So that's why you have to do it right now while you're still on previous versions turn it off and then wait. Doesn't matter which version you're running, just wait. And when iOS 26 is actually available, it's gonna show up right here, you're gonna update, and from now on, you're not gonna have betas on your iPhone anymore. You're gonna be in the normal cycle of iOS 26 like everybody else, all right? So that's pretty much it. Hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you on the next one as usual. Bye-bye, guys.